Russians said their final farewell to one of the leading lights of the opposition on Tuesday. The body of 55-year-old Boris Nemtsov was laid in an open casket as thousands in Moscow came to pay their respects, lines stretching far down the street. A vocal critic of President Vladimir Putin's rule, Nemtsov was shot late Friday while walking home from a restaurant just meters from the Kremlin. Among the mourners was former British Prime Minister John Major, who first met Nemtsov in the early 1990s and says he admired much of what the man stood for. If anyone believes that his voice will be silenced by his murder, then I believe they have made a very serious error. I think his death will accelerate his message. And it will be an echo chamber for that for a very long time to come. But Grigory Yavlinsky, the leader of the left-leaning Yabloko party, goes further. He says Nemtsov's death will have immediate and serious ramifications. That means the escalation of the war inside Russia, not only in Ukraine, but just overall the country. And that means the escalation of fear, and uh, it means the escalation of the repressions on the, everybody who disagreed with the Putin's policy. Russian investigators say they are actively working to track down the killers of the Kremlin critic, the man whose murder, some say, reveals the hazards of speaking out against Vladimir Putin.